For more on this game now, we turn to Mike Carmen, who covers the Boilermakers for the Lafayette Journal and Courier. Mike, you know this Purdue program really well. When's the last time this fan base had as much excitement for a game as they do for this one? Uh, I think you probably have to go back to 2004. Uh, now, that game against Wisconsin had more national implications and more Big Ten implications than this game coming up on Saturday has. But it's, it's probably the most meaningful game since then uh, when you look at what kind of step this would mean for Purdue's current program and what kind of step it would have meant uh, more than a decade ago for Joe Tiller's program. Yeah, what's the biggest thing in your mind that happened to get them here? What did Jeff Brom do to exceed expectations? Well, I think the, the major storyline of this, of this team this season is its defense. Uh, you know, over the last four or five years, uh, they've, been, they've been gutted. Uh, they've given up big chunks of yards, a lot of points. I think twice in the last four years, a uh, visiting team has come to Ross State Stadium and, and set the opponent's scoring record. Penn State and Ohio State's done that. So they've, they've really uh, played well defensively. They've, they've really held up against the run uh, really well. And to me, that's, that's the reason that they're in this position right now is because their defense has kept them in every game. Yeah, pretty remarkable when you consider the reputation for Jeff Brom was as an offensive guy, but he and Nick Holt have done a fabulous job with that D. So spinning forward to this game against the Hoosiers, what does Purdue need to do to win, Mike? Well, they're going to have to figure out a way to move the ball consistently. You know, last week against Iowa, they came up with some big plays down the field, which is something we haven't seen a lot uh, from this offense this year. They have a very small uh, window. Uh, they, they can't make big mistakes uh, and if they do it, it ends up costing them uh, defensively they still have to they got to take away the run and they've got to figure out a way not to let Simeon Cobbs have a big game uh, against them uh, in the passing game Mike Carmen from the Journal and Courier Mike thanks for your time and for your insights have a great holiday and enjoy the game on Saturday thank you